guys, this is That's Nancy iPhone Guy, and we're going to take a look at a very neat application that is 99 cents in the App Store. And I got a complaint. One guy said, you know what, this app is, is decent. This app is alright. He said, you always say that. So I'm unsubscribing. Well, for you, pal, I'm going to tell you, yes, buy this app. No, do not buy this app. This app, Distant Shore, absolutely, 100%, yes, buy this app. It's 99 cents, and it's from the same people that made Koi Pond. Now, Koi Pond was the number one selling paid app in the App Store. Koi Pond, yeah, okay, cool, not really. Um, so, I mean, I wasn't, I was thinking, man, this case is going to be, or this app is going to be no good. I was falser than ever. This game is called Distant Shore, and it's from the Blimp Pilots. Okay, now, it's only on one side, landscape, no, upside down, no. There's only one thing, you know, right? All right, so what you do is you are on a freaking beach. It is awesome. Okay, so what you do is you just walk around. As you can see, there's these little fit prints in the sand. Really nice little feature. They walk to where you want, so you point. And there you go. And you walk around. Now, you see that glowing thing? If we zoom in here, which we can't, we see that it's a shell. I apologize for this zooming problem. Uh, we see that it's a shell, okay? You walk over to the shell, pick it up. Blam. I have four shells. Every five shells, you get to send a message to someone in the ocean or in the world. Other people with iPhones that have this application. Now you're like, what? So here we go, five shells. There we go. We got them. So here's what we're going to do. We go into our little bag right here. And we go to this section, right there. Now I have eight bottles. I click one, and here you go. There's a parchment that shows up, a little parchment paper. You click it, the keyboard comes up, and you say, hello, friend. Or we'll say, hello from salt. I can't spell. Salt Lake City, Utah. This is that snazzy, oh dear, I can't type, iPhone guy. Please become my pen pal. Okay? It's composed. There it is. Written with heartfelt dignity. And uh, then we push compose or launch. What happens is then the bottle is tossed into the ocean. And somewhere around the world that has this application will get my message. They can then reply or discard it, whichever, and they will become my pen pals. Now, as you're walking along the beach, it's very, I don't want to say rare, but you see much more shells. You'll find a bottle here on the shore. And I'm sure that's because, oh, we found one. No way. And that's because there's probably not that many people with applications, this application. Uh, so we need to get people to use it so we can get more people to play that makes no sense, I apologize. So there's the bottle. We click it, we walk over, and a hallelujah. The parchment is then placed inside our thing. So now we push the view thing, and there we go. There's a star indicating that it is a new message. And the message says, what's your favorite movie? So then we will go to the top here and push reply. And my favorite movie would have to be I have no idea. So I'm going to say Iron Man. How about yours? Not GPRS, yours. There we go. It's composed. I push send and it goes into the atmosphere. I throw it into the ocean and the person who sent me that message, or the person who launched that message, will now get a response from me. And that response will say, Iron Man. All right? He gets that. He can then reply, and you can reply back and forth. Now, you can report explicit messages if they do exist. I haven't actually even seen any, so that's good. But uh, they do take preliminary actions towards that. Push the indicator button, the indicator, the info button up here. And it gives you a list. What is this game? What's it about? Sound, navigation, help, which is what do I do? Um, news, which is news about the blimp pilots, and uh, about, which is about this application. 
right there, distant shore, the app, the blimp pilot. So then we push return back to the game. Now we are going to go back to our hammock by pushing this one right here. We go back, and there we go. One thing I've noticed is it does seem like nighttime in the game, which bothers me a little bit. I wish it was brighter, but you know. Now if you see there, that's a little tortoise. It's a little mail delivery guy. He has a mail in his mouth. Now I was sending mail to people last night, and so this means I've gotten a response from someone. Cool. We pick it up, and there it is. We take it, and oh, by the way, all your messages are in there. So once you fill up, or once you don't need that message anymore, you discard it, push confirm, and it poofs into the atmosphere. All right. Now we push this new one, and it says, congratulations, your or you sent your first bottle into the ocean. Now this is not, this is, anyway, uh, this is not from someone. Someone soon will then receive that bottle and it will wash up onto their beach. In the finder, uh, if I can't read, I'm sorry. If the finder decides to reply, the reply message will be in your mailbox, which is what I just chose. Don't forget, people who read more bottles tend to find more bottles. Have fun, the blimp pilots. Cool. All right, so that's awesome. Apparently, the more bottles you read, the more you're going to find. So there is a little reward for doing and contributing to this app. Now, it's just really fun. I mean, it's a beach. There's nothing overly special about it. I mean, you just walk around, send messages to people, you get to know people, and you just have fun. I mean, this is a, I don't know, I really like this application. There's nothing in particular that I like about it. Just overall, it's a fun experience. It's something you can open for five minutes, write a quick message, or write a quick reply, and then get it all from all your friends. I mean, it's fun. It's great. It's 99 cents. It's in the App Store. From the Blimp Pilots, it is called Distant Shore. So I highly recommend you check it out. And as always, guys, stay snazzy. Thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you later.